Handling toxicity in online gaming communities requires proactive moderation, clear guidelines, and fostering a positive environment where players feel safe and respected. Here's a concise guide on how to handle toxicity in online gaming communities in 8 to 10 short paragraphs. 1. Establish clear community guidelines. Start by defining and communicating clear community guidelines that outline expected behavior, language standards, and consequences for toxicity. Clearly state a zero-tolerance policy for harassment, hate speech, bullying, and other forms of toxic behavior. 2. Empower moderators and community leaders. Empower moderators and community leaders with the authority and tools to enforce guidelines effectively. Train them in conflict resolution, active listening, and de-escalation techniques to address toxic behavior promptly and impartially. 3. Implement reporting and moderation tools. Integrate reporting features and moderation tools within gaming platforms, forums, or community servers to enable players to report toxic behavior easily. Ensure that reports are reviewed promptly, and appropriate action is taken based on the severity of the offense. 4. Foster a culture of respect and sportsmanship. Promote a culture of respect, sportsmanship, and empathy among community members through positive reinforcement, role modeling, and recognition of fair play. Encourage players to support and uplift each other, fostering a more inclusive and supportive gaming environment. 5. Educate players on consequences. Educate players about the consequences of toxic behavior, including account suspensions, bans, and restrictions from community activities. Clearly communicate the enforcement of guidelines to deter potential offenders and uphold community standards. 6. Encourage positive communication channels. Encourage positive communication channels, such as team chat, voice comms, and social media, where players can engage constructively and respectfully. Discourage anonymous or unmonitored platforms that may facilitate toxic behavior. 7. Provide support and resources. Offer support resources for players affected by toxicity, including reporting mechanisms, counseling services, and community support groups. Empower victims to seek help and provide guidance on managing and coping with negative experiences. 8. Foster diversity and inclusivity. Promote diversity and inclusivity within the community by celebrating different backgrounds, identities, and skill levels. Embrace cultural sensitivity and representation in game content, events, and community initiatives to create a welcoming environment for all players. 9. Lead by example and encourage positive role models. Lead by example as community leaders, game developers, and influencers by demonstrating respectful behavior and addressing toxicity proactively. Highlight positive role models within the community who exemplify sportsmanship and support positive interactions. 10. Regularly evaluate and adapt strategies. Continuously evaluate the effectiveness of toxicity management strategies through community feedback, data analysis, and moderation reports. Adapt policies, moderation practices, and educational initiatives to address evolving challenges and maintain a healthy gaming community. By implementing these strategies, gaming communities can proactively address toxicity, promote positive behavior, and create a safer and more enjoyable environment for all players to thrive and enjoy their gaming experiences.